Hello everybody and welcome once again to another episode of Galactic Science 2. So, in this episode we're going to start building a mob grinding place. I think I'll do it outside. I thought about doing it below but it actually it can be difficult. Because I've got no weapons. I've lost, I seem to have lost my turret or my lasers. I don't know where they've gone to. Anyway, let's have a look. I used to have some turrets. I'm sure I had some turrets in here. I've got plenty of these turret concealers and things but I don't know where the actual lasers have gone to so let's go outside and also we need to fix something first I'm going to do change we'll make change actually I'm going to do a change here I forgot about it last time I thought it was a good idea to do it this time I'm going to move this out of the way here and I'm going to move it one to the right here let's turn my magnet on like put it down here and I definitely did lose my book from last time as well so let's just break this hopper we don't need this hopper here now and what I'm going to do is put a chest on here like this and I'm going to put a transferred node because on top of this oops missed try again <laughs> No, I'll reach that chest. That's weird. It's still up here. I must be able to reach it. There we go. And I'm going to put a stack upgrade into this there. So then anything we put into that will go down a stack at a time. So for example, coal. We can put coal. Ah, yes, I need to open this up, don't I? Let's just break that. And then we can put the coal in there. And you see it's now disappearing a stack at a time coming into here fairly quickly and we can also do these let's get those out of the way so fishing rods and coal and it'll just carry on working now and we'll get all the pro residue or products in here and it get this time it doesn't empty out like it was doing before so it's maintaining a good speed I wonder if I can get that block yeah I can so that's that little change I wanted to make what else is happening in here? Let's have a look. Quick sort. We'll get rid of as much of this stone bits as we can. And um, it looks like the quarry is finished. So I could probably take a stack of. Well, maybe I can't. A stack of cobblestone in here like that. I mean, a stack of carbon and put that into there. And take the stone out of there. Very good. Right. So <laughs> I'm wasting time. I don't want to do that. Because you know building these things always takes a bit of time to do. And that will do. I don't think I want this mint with me either. So what I'm planning to do. Oh yes, I also remember something else I need to do. I don't... I guess it's actually working that we've got seven pieces of cactus in there. So that's good. But when I came out and on my checks I noticed there was a piece of um, cactus which had actually escaped. So I need some more moon dirt, don't I? Let me go and get some more moon dirt. I should have picked it up on my way, but I forgot. I'm just got a, I think I've got a stack of moon dirt in here like this. That'll be fine. Actually, give us a couple of steps of moon dirt, because we can use that for building purposes anyway. Because the sandy glass that I made last time should be ready. So we can make some dark glass for what I can do. So I can simply jump up, can't I, and press that like that. And that goes how far around? Does that really go the whole way around? Amazing. I didn't expect that to do that. So now that should be high enough to catch any bits. Oops, there you go, there's one. Fortunately, I got my magnet on them. Never mind. So let's go and do this. Start doing this mob grinding area. I think over here looks like a sensible sort of area. It's probably in range of those lasers, so if anything gets out, we're probably all right. So let's take this, and then we want to control. No, it's actually moon. That's moon dirt. That's moon dirt. Hold on. That's no, not working. 
So I probably want it to be about five high or something like that. By about seven. Well, that'll probably be a good starting point, won't it? So I would like to sort of come here and then sort of harvest the harvest the, the products or the, the mobs from here. So what I think we need to do is oh, I do need to make something else. I could either use water, and let them spawn and drop down, like this type of principle, or because we've got open blocks in this mod pack, we can use the um, we can use the fans. I think I need have stone I think is what I needed for fans so I think that's why I made some stone let's put that up there so spikes I did already prepared those um, fan three pages of fan oh fantasy gold okay here we go we'll make um, oh I need some slabs do I all right, no big deal. We'll make some slabs. Actually, I can't do this, but I can do these stone. Where's it gone to? I think this will be more than enough. We don't need about three. Or I think we'll make three fans. should be enough I should be able to make three fans with that one we also of course need to make some levers um, yes I don't know why I'm doing it like this well, actually, I actually do because it means I don't have to find things in there and run a cobblestone and if I shift click that now we should get the three so that'll match up to those that'll be fine so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut I'm not sure how far the fans blow so we're going to find that oh my goodness look at that it actually can fly up this high did you see that there was a piece of uh, cactus I just picked up so that means I'm going to push this up one more layer one more level there we go and that should keep everything in place so Let's put the fans down one block away from this like this. And I want to start, let's place, start placing a wall down. So I'm running out of moon dirt, that's bad. I can always harvest some more, I suppose. So let's say this is the outside part of it here. And I want to get behind it to turn the fans on and off. So let's just remove this one here like that. And then put another layer down like this. And I want it about five wide. That's obviously more than five. So let's come along here and then stand here. Oh, in fact, what I'll do is I'll put one block down here like this. Oh, I can't. That's not good. Because I would like to put the fan down here. So I remove this corner block. I stand on this one here. That should give an angle if I can reach this part. Don't really need the clock. Oh, actually, I don't need this. I'll put the clock down there. So I would like the fan. So it needs to push a little bit inwards. So if I stand just here like that, with a bit of luck, I can reach it. No, I can't. Like that. So that'll blow slightly inwards, which is what I want to achieve. And I'll do the same thing over the other side here. But five, one. So that's one, two, three, four, five. I think that's the end of it, isn't it? Yes. So I can do these two and take that corner piece off so I can put the fan down. I know what I did earlier last time, I just came in basically two, didn't I, like this? To put the magnet back on again. And I want to push it down so it's around about this angle. Like that. And then in the middle we want to just do one in the middle, so let's just put one down here like this. I want to be straight. I think if I press shift it'll do it straight anyway. It looks fairly good. So the next thing to do is to find out how far we get pushed back. 
So let's take these three levers here. I probably have to do it like that, do I? Yep. Make sure that they're. I can jump up quite high actually. Still. So let's turn those fans on. Oh, you see that's starting to push. So I'll now put this block back in here. This is actually a fairly mob, a standard mod design actually. Nothing special at all. Put those three fans on. I'll see how far we get pushed away. So I'm getting pushed away to around about here. So if I put this as the end all here, let's just do it like that. Let's just walk in again and see what happens. Yes, we're getting pushed to that, no problem. Yes, I think that'll do fine. So what I want to do now is to bring this one across like this. Take this piece off, which is hard now because we've got these fans on, but I'm sure, we'll, I'm sure we'll succeed. There we are. And I'm slightly above the fan, so that's not a big deal. So that's the area. So I just need to fill it in. And I would like also to put the spikes down. So the spikes are going to go here at the front. In fact, here's where they want to put the spikes. So let's put the spikes down here. And I want them to be one block below the surface, don't I? But I think I actually want them two blocks below the surface, so that the mobs will fall down and give me a better air, a better striking distance, as it were. So they're going to fall down into here. This is the idea. I also need to make sure I keep my eye on the time because it is coming towards night time. So we just put these down like this. And then we should be able to come down in front of it like this. Um, so we just basically need then this to be covered up like that. And then they should fall down. So now we need to make it a bit higher. So where's my uh, wand? Yep, that's good. Now I've run out of moon dirt. I just need to get some more moon dirt. I think I've got some in the thing. Let's have a look in here. What are you doing now? It never works when you try to click in that. Do you? Ten. So it seems to be working. So I think I've got some moon dirt in here. Oh yeah, 16,000. The reason I've got the moon dirt in there is because I need to make oil. So I'm keeping some back for to produce oil, to refine oil into rocket fuel, I think is what we have to do. That's four high. I'm going to go another high one, I think. And then we'll put the roof on that. So let's just go down. Oh, well, I'll do it in the side, of course. But I think I'll turn off the fans while I'm doing this. Oh, we'll just come in the side like this. Now we need to black it out, basically. So if I hold down this. Yep, that's fine. That's, I'm pressing shift now. Right, now if I press F4, this area should be pretty dark. Well, zero. That's pretty dark. Now I'm also going to put into some, some up here some iron spikes for spiders. So we basically want three, don't we? So one in the middle like that. Actually, I can do it like this, can't I? And that will keep any spiders at bay, I think. And what I want to do now is I want to come down here, because this is where they're going to land. And we should be able to get at them from here. So let's fill this up again. And turn on these fans. In fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove this area here. I think I'll have to use this hammer moment, because I don't want to break up what I've just done. 
and then just go down one level here. Like that. Put that, I should turn that one off. And then we can turn these on. And while that's working, or hopefully working, I'll have to come down here. Make a little a little passageway so I can see what the mobs are. And I think I need to come down three. So look. I think that'll do. I'm not sure if I need to be one block above this, but certainly the mobs can't see me, which is exactly what I want. So let's let that do its stuff and see if we get any mobs spawning in that area. We should be able to see it because um, on the minimap anyway, if nothing else. I'll make some dark glass in the meantime. Pull those away, don't. Yeah, I'll leave the cactus there for the time being. And moon dirt we can put in. We'll put it over in this chest at the back here. Make sure we've got a reasonably clear, empty inventory. Not perfect. And I'm thinking about putting some half slabs down. I might need to put those down anyway, so we can see. I might be able to do to get the mobs. So let's have a look. I wanted to make some dark glass, don't I? So let's look at the dark glass. The recipe for that was this one. So we need these blackout curtains. Well, 12 should be enough. Oh, there'll be enough for now. So we just need the we just need the glass, don't we? We've got plenty of glass. Should all be in here. 20 pieces. Could even make reinforced, it might even be more sensible to make reinforced. So that's basically dark glass with four obsidian. Gives me four, so I'm not losing out. So we want dark glass. Like, let's put that in there, and that in there, and then click that out so we get 15. What are we short of? Just some more. But I will, yes, I'll make the, I'll make the 20. So we'll just do that again. And then we'll make the reinforced dark glass just in case there's any anybody can see us. Let's put that in there like that. Twenty good. Don't need the spikes, I don't think. And I've just put the dark glass into there, haven't I? Yep. So we should be able to come along here now and add some dark glass and see the mobs if we've got any spawning. It's not yet quite night time. And I can hear somebody. So look. But I can't. Oh, there's one. Look. What is it? It must be a zombie. Yeah, an evolved zombie with half a heart. So I got the achievement Monster Hunter, but I didn't get any XP. So maybe I need to put some slabs down here. Let's do that next. What happens if I take out one of these? I think what we'll do, we'll take out this one first of all. Oh, there's my XP there. Put that into that in place. Let's see, maybe I'm not sure I like the reinforced dark glass. That was something else that X head reducers. Quite good. Oh, yes. Coming up towards night time, so let me just finish this off. Let's just do that's five. But we can do it like this, which that should be twenty. 
Oh, can I use my magic wand on this? That'd be good if I can. Yep. More of a time saver when I come up here. Oh yes, it is good actually. I quite like this. So they can't see me now. So what I think I need to do is come down one more layer down here like this. And then put some slabs on the top of this like this. On the top half. And let's press um, F4 now. So we've got lots of completely dark areas. And the whole of this is dark. So we shall now see if this actually works. I think I have to... Uh-oh. Still not high enough. I don't believe it. They really do fly out of there, don't they? 15. Right, they get another layer of that, so that's no big deal. And of course it doesn't... Oh, I'll press F4, I don't need that anymore, do I? Let's get some more moon dirt out of there. 32 should be enough for another layer of that uh, cactus farm. I don't want to put a, a roof on that, because if I do, it might not grow so fast. It might need daylight to grow. I'm not, to be honest with you, I'm not 100% sure about that. There we go. That should keep those at bay, and we can then see if anything spawns into here. Okay. It's just now, it's sort of a waiting game. While I'm going to wait, let's do some gardening. Oops. I just fell in a bucket of some water, which is not actually that cool. So we have to put this back again now. and get the potatoes as well. A little bit like, well, while I'm doing this, though, something will have spawned and we can go and do that. Or maybe another idea, rather than do this, oh, I've got a carrot. I think the carrot's, oh, no, that's the right place. How do we get these mushrooms? Oh, that's nice and uh, flat, so to speak. Nobody in there yet. So what I'm going to do is put this food away, get my oxygen recharged, because I think it's actually night time now. Uh, oxygen, let's do that first. Oh yes, look at that. And let's put the rest of this stuff into here. And my first mushrooms. Magic. So, What do I want to do next? Put some moon rock away over here, I think. And the moon dirt. And, um, hmm. Oh, yes. I need to do that. But I don't need to do that on camera, do I? That's already full of carbon. Fantastic. Let's check this chest. It's empty. Let's put a stack of carbon in there. Oh, yes, we need to go and have a sleep now because it's night time. it says I've earned the achievement monster to whenever you upgrade it seems that, well actually the way I upgrade at the moment is I'm upgrading by um oh, I'm still spitting stuff out it's going to drive me crazy that maybe I just have to put some more walls down here to keep it so that they don't come out what do we have 15 last time 18 so it's sort of working we're not catching everything yet which is a shame this doesn't look like it's working very well at all. Come on, mobs, we want to see you. I don't see why you're not coming. I don't think I can make anything like Cursed Earth or anything like that. Um, let's have a look, see if we can actually make Cursed Earth. I'd be very surprised. Yes. 
we have to do the ritual and I don't want to do any rituals because that's one of those rituals I don't yes yeah, so I don't think we can do that anyway because we, we need to basically grind the wither for doing that so that's out of, out of the question and there were no other recipes for cursed earth in this mod pack right what am I going to do so we're going to have to wait for those mobs to spawn if and maybe I have to clear out some more areas as well like some other areas up but if I do that I need to do that then we can do that off camera can't we so let's just take those out of there and those out of there put those and those and let's and leave that for the time being do you know that went faster than I thought it was going to do I must be honest except for the fact I haven't got any mobs yet building it took it was just a lot faster than I expected to do oh yes I know what to do let's just fill that in anyway oops I press the wrong button so until next time I'm going to say bye for now and I wish you all the best until then